can't get on this. You got it. Are you from the back? everyone welcome back to my channel and I just wanted as you guys can tell there is a mess in my garage and I was I was cleaning my garage I was like I am going to vlog my move as I mentioned on my get to know me video we are a military family and we're usually on the go on um, every three years so this year Right now, it's going to be about three years and five months that we've been here in, our, in this location right now. And we're getting ready to relocate this week. Um, and I just want to bring you guys along. I want to share the journey of what it's like moving and with the military. And today is May 31st. And I am cleaning up. We are cleaning, not just me. Me and my husband have been cleaning out the garage. We took everything down from the attic, but that's something that you need to do. They will not take it down for you. You have to bring it down. So we took everything down and we went through, we're going through boxes to what we're going to keep, what we're going to donate, or what we're throwing away. And tomorrow the packing company is going to come, the, com the moving company is going to come, and they are going to pack the entire house. And Wednesday it is um, load day. So, I'm going to bring you guys along. I'm going to share the good, the bad, everything, you name it. <laughs> um, but I'm so excited. We're so excited for this new location and what. So, like I said, we are, we put everything now from the attic. And now we're just going through stuff. Things that we're going to keep. We're going to donate. We just have so much stuff. Um, I'm hoping to get, we're really planning to get this done today before they come tomorrow and then we need to make room because that's our service door and we are selling our washer and dryer and they're picking that up this evening. Hey everyone, um, I just woke up as you guys can tell. I am exhausted. Yesterday we went to bed at 1 in the morning. Um, today is day 2 as you guys can tell. We got the garage squared out, it's ready to be packed. Um, we're focusing on the inside today. Packers are coming today and today is June 1st. Um, I'm so excited and sad at the same time um, because we have created so many memories in this home, but it is time to go. And as I was putting the stuff on the walls last night in the inside of the house, I had to put everything down from the walls I I stopped for a few minutes and I just you know I it has been a good time here it has been a good time um, like I mentioned in my little previous vlog and today's packing day um, the packers are coming and we are ready to go it is 7 30 right now and we will see you guys later Here's the garage, it's pretty much ready. And we're gonna focus on the inside today. Hey you all, so I just wanted to do a quick little update on how things are going. Um, as you can tell, the house is pretty much packed up. Um, they have been doing amazing, so I guess they're gonna be done by tonight and tomorrow's slow day. Um, so this is the living room. Everything's it's kind of I got kind of emotional, but it is what it is, you know. It's part of being a military family. This is the kitchen. Everything is completely packed here. Um, and this is the playroom. Playroom is pretty empty. 
see. But yes, it is going well. So we only have keeping my fingers crossed that they get to fill up the master tonight. Hey everyone, I just wanted to do a little checkup today on how things are going. Um, our house is completely empty. We were packed yesterday and they load everything into the moving truck today. Um, all our stuff is going into storage due to our home and our new duty station not being available. So we will not be doing a door-to-door -door move, which that is one of the things that a lot of people like doing because your items will not be going to storage. But in this occasion, you know, things change, plans change for us, and it was just the option that to, for us to go to have a door-to-door -to -move, door -door move was not in the books for us. And it's totally fine. We just get a lot of extra time with our parents and our family, and we're totally grateful for that. But as you guys can see, our entire house is empty. There is, is like a bittersweet feeling. Um, we built a lot of memories in this home. We welcome our last member of our family, which is our son. And so much happened as, you know, for my husband and I as a couple in our marriage. Um, and we are so grateful to have had this opportunity to be based here in Alabama. But we're excited for our next move. We're excited for this new adventure with the Air Force. Um, Um, we made it to my parents house in Michigan yesterday and now we're gonna stay here for two to three weeks because our house in Georgia is not ready to be moved in, into um, which that's just part of you know enjoying the roller coaster like my husband and I had planned that we were gonna do a door to door move. We were not gonna, um, we were gonna do it right this time, but that was not in God's plan. Um, he wanted us to come back home and have all this quality time with my parents, his parents, and our entire family, and we're gonna do just that. Um, we're supposed to leave here on June 21st. I mean, I have to leave June 20th. Um, because we're supposed to close in our home in Georgia on June 21st and we'll see how it goes. That's the plan for now, but who knows if anything is going to change. Um, I am going to finish this video here with this last update because I don't want to make it too long. So when I start my drive to Georgia, I will do another vlog and do a empty house tour for you all and delivery of our belongings and how that goes and redecorating and making the house in Georgia our new home. So for the next upcoming videos, it's going to be more of 
getting the house ready, decorating ideas, decorating in a budget, and all that fun stuff because I love doing that. And we're gonna redo since we're um, done grading. We're we just our home in Alabama was a six bedroom home, and we're just downgrading to a three bedroom. Um, just because this mom right here is tired of cleaning, and I do not want to deal with that big of a home anymore. I just cannot. That's just was too much on me and on my family trying to keep up with a big home and now we're just going to downsize and I'm happy with that. Um, so we're going to put the little ones, the toddlers together and we're going to redo their room. But we're going to do it in a budget because we ain't got tons of money to be doing all crazy stuff about decorating and I want to share with you all how we do it. I am going to try to work with the stuff that we have and just add to what we already have. Um, so I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching this vlog. And if you guys have any questions, if you're a new military spouse and you have any questions, don't hesitate to message me on Instagram or comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like this video. And let me know what else you wanna see from this move. I know it's a lot. This is my fourth time moving with the military as a military spouse. And I just, this time around, I told my husband, I'm just going to go with the flow. I'm not trying to, I'm not going to stress it. I am just going to enjoy the ride and be happy. <laughs> um, because there's things out of our hands that we can't control and it happens. And it's part of the journey. I'll see you guys next time and bye.